design and implementation of a microcontroller-based car parking system. The car parking system can control up to 16 cars at the maximum. A vacant or unoccupied parking slot is designated with a green or red turned on LED respectively. A numerical LED and the green LED turned on indicate the number of available spots. The 7 second display shows the number of available parking spots on the system. As you can see on the display, there are 7 available parking spots because there are 16 in total parking spots with 9 being occupied, therefore 16 minus 9 is 7, 7 available. Also, the green LED on the left side of the display shows that there are still available parking spots for people to park in. Looking at the display board behind it, you will notice that each parking spot is identified by its color LED, green being unoccupied, red being occupied. The system keeps track of the total amount of time each car is parked at the parking lot and it charges each car based on the charge timetable embedded in the program and displays the total amount of money each driver owes the parking operator or owner. The operator can review different records of time and charges related to each parked car by depressing the minus and plus keys installed at the bottom side of the LED display. As you can see on the screen, the operator can use the minus or the plus key to check out each car that is listed in the parking spots to be able to tell how much time it has been parked there and how much to charge. In the prototype system, when a car enters the parking area, a toggle switch is depressed to turn on a red LED manually to inform the system that the indicated slot is now occupied. When a car goes out, activation of the same toggle switch causes the red LED to be turned off and the green one to be turned on to indicate that the spot is now vacant. As you can see in the model, a car has entered the parking spot and when you press down on the toggle switch, it indicates that the spot is now occupied and the number of available slots changes from 4 to 3. Each time a car enters the parking area, the system automatically deducts one unit from the total number of cars that can be parked in the parking area and displays the total number of available slots left. A new car has entered the parking area. As you can see, the number of available slots goes from 3 to 2. The operator makes the arm gate move up after a driver has paid the related parking charge by pressing the paid key installed at the bottom side of the LED display. Notice on the screen that once the operator presses the paid key, the car that is leaving makes the available spots go up from 2 to 3 again. When a car goes out, one unit will be automatically added to the number of available spots in the parking area. When repeating the same action, the number of available slots goes from 3 to 4. When 16 cars are parked, a signal light, or a red LED indicator, starts flickering with a frequency of 1.5 Hz to notify other drivers that there is no vacancy in the parking area. Notice on the screen that all the spots are filled up and that the red LED to the left is flickering with the frequency of 1.5 Hz. During the time that the parking area is full, if any driver tries to get into the parking area, the entrance arm gate does not go up. Also, the red LED continues flickering with the frequency of 3 Hz. Notice when a car is trying to get into the parking area, the arm gate will not go up and the red LED is flickering with a frequency of 3 Hz. To purchase this product, please visit www.plcgoods.com or look for us at retailers such as eBay or Amazon. Thank you for watching and please subscribe to our channel for more products. Thank you!